My name is Jalen Wolf, and I am Miss Kettle and Stony Point Junior. Today, I'm here to get to talk about the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls, specifically the Faceless Doll Projects. What is the Faceless Doll Project? Why are the dolls faceless? And why is it so important? What dates do we honor the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls, and how can you honor them? There are two dates in the year that we come together as a nation to honor our missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls on October 4th and May 5th. On October 4th, Sisters in Spirit vigils are held, and on May 5th, Red Dress Day is held. Red dresses are displayed in windows, porches, schools, and business offices. Show your support on these days to give others the understanding of this tragedy. Together we are doing something. Remember each one of the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls is a strong, brave Indigenous woman. What can you do to honor the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls? Be the voice for someone who hasn't found theirs yet. Offer a prayer for the families of the MMIWG. Spread kindness in the world. Who made the Faceless Skull Project and how is it made? The Faceless Skull Quilt was made by grades 4 to 8 during the winter of 2016 at St. Anthony School. The school gym was used to create this faceless doll quilt. The students carefully created their faceless doll by choosing a color of braided hair, dress, and accessories to show each MMIWG. The faceless dolls were then sewn onto the quilt and the quilt was officially displayed at the For Our School and Sisters benefit on April 2nd, 2016. Making this quilt together gives them a voice. Together we are doing something. Here is a picture that was taken at the benefit of NKO Grand Chief Sheila North Wilson, Sagin Chief Vern Rhodes, and Maywash Chief Greg Nandalong. It was an honor to stand with these leaders at the benefit for the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls. I'm now going to share with you a dance of healing for these families of the missing and murdered Indigenous women and girls. This is my red dress, my jingle dress. The jingle dress dance is a healing dance.
song by Matthew West that I hope inspires you to do something. Silence no more, never forgotten, no more stolen sisters. Thank you, you betcha. This morning, saw a world full of trouble now. I thought, how do we ever get so far down? And how's it ever gonna turn around? So I turned my eyes to heaven. I thought, God, why don't you do something? Well, I just couldn't bear the thought of people living in poverty, children sold into slavery. The thought disgusted me, so I shook my fist at heaven. Change the world. 